China and India are vastly different from the rest of Eurasia. Unlike other regions, Asia has clung to polytheism and Hindu beliefs and does not practice monotheism, unlike Europe and other places. One possible reason why is because of the Tibetan Himalayan Plateau. The plateau with many rich minerals spews forth several major rivers, and these rivers carry these nutrients into the soil of China and India. And thus, there is a lot less fighting because there is so much food and resources to go around, and everyone accepts each other's gods. And thus, in the case of resource-poor tribal communities, individual tribes would worship a small number of gods, while entire regions would collectively worship ten or more gods. So once India and China became unified, there was no pressure to become monotheistic because they had so many resources. Wheat, barley, millet, rice, and other foods were dependent on the mineral-rich and plentiful water and rivers from Tibet. And this stands in stark contrast to Europe and the Middle East with smaller rivers and more competition, thus leading to monotheism in these lands and arcane beliefs in India and China. This may apply to Africa and America too, but this is simply a theory and it's not confirmed.